Hi guys, this is Ashley from Tia's Company One, and you already know what it's going to be. It's going to be exclusive tea on the reason why other male rappers don't like Drake. And we also going to be getting to the Rihanna and Hassan breakup. Before we get into anything, like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you turn on post notification. Follow Tia's Company One, and this little exclusive is strictly for entertainment purposes only. Anyway... So, as you guys know, um, T.I., the messiest man, the messiest short man in rap, decided to drop a song and mention that um, Drake got peed on by his friend. Okay? And Meek um, did a, I guess, a diss track to Drake that nobody cared about. And he stated the same thing well obviously it is true because um ti said that it was true but what people don't realize is that ti does not like drake that's why he mentioned it okay ti um rap career is dead and gone and so He's doing everything he could to revive it by, you know, having Lil Baby on his record, talking about Drake. And the reason why a lot of these rappers don't like Drake is because, one, they feel like Drake got it easy in the game. He never really had to rap about being... um I guess, less unfortunate or homeless or or anything like that. And a lot of people feel like um, Drake had it easy. They feel like he was privileged. That's one reason why these rappers do not like Drake. They feel like he's never really had to suffer. You know, he never talked about robbing anybody, stealing anything. Another reason why um, these male rappers do not like Drake is because Drake be smashing all the chicks in the game, okay? These Instagram models, these A-list celebrities, Drake be smashing, okay? Drake is known as Mr. Steal Your Girl, not Trey Songs. okay? That, that title belongs to Drake, okay? Drake be taking these men... They be, he be taking their girlfriends, their side chicks, and these rappers cannot stand it, okay? Um, he actually, he actually slept with DJ Drama's girl, and that's why DJ Drama don't like him, and that's why DJ Drama told Meek that Drake really don't write his raps, that he really doesn't write all his raps, and that's where he got that information from. People like to blame Onika, but they really need to blame DJ Drama for being a drama king. Why did he do that? Why did he do it? Jealousy. They are all jealous of Drizzy Drake because he's the one of the most successful rappers to this date. He hasn't really fell off yet. And he keeps taking their girls and he doesn't pretend to be hard. They don't like that. Now on to Rihanna and Hassan. Now earlier this year in January, um, it was made it made it onto the blogs how Rihanna and Hassan um ended their three year relationship. Well, actually, they broke up in 2019 not 2020 they broke up in october 2019 um for various different reasons but what i really want to get into today is the real reason what really was the nail in the coffin for rihanna hassan now if you guys remember in 2019 in october Rihanna um, went to Drake's birthday party and somebody DM me this information and gave me proof and I and they had receipts okay so 
allegedly Rihanna was supposed to go to Paris for her and Hassan's anniversary in October. And instead, she ditched Hassan and went to Drake's birthday party. Then after that, she started hanging out with ASAP Rocky and went to Switzerland with ASAP. She was going to concerts with ASAP Rocky and she was just all over the blogs and ASAP Rocky was right beside her. And that really pissed Hassan off. So he basically was ignoring her after that moment because I guess they had lived together allegedly in London. So he uh, was ignoring her texts. Um, he wouldn't answer her phone calls allegedly. And so um, in December, he moved out. In December, he um, packed his things December of 2019 and left their, I guess, house or apartment in London. And um, that's not the last time they had spoken, but that's the last time. Um, that's when they officially broke up. Because in October, when she was seen out with Drake, they had not officially broken up. She kind of jumped the gun. And uh, they had gotten to an argument. And that's why she did not spend their anniversary. To, that's why they didn't spend their anniversary together. And that pissed Hassan off. Because Hassan, I believe he's in his 40s or he's 40. And so he's older, so he really doesn't like to play those type of games. And so, um, allegedly, Rihanna has been trying to get Hassan back. But she hasn't fully gotten him back yet. Um, and I honestly, I honestly believe that that ship has sailed. Um, because it's been a year now. And we would have seen them together by now. So that is the tea for Rihanna and Hassan about the reason why they really broke up. She jumped the gun after they got into an argument and decided um, to prance around town with Drake and ASAP Rocky. And so now they are no longer together. The argument, I believe, was about marriage. But anywho, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications if you like this little exclusive tea that I got. Um, make sure you follow Tia's company, one, and tune in for more exclusives. I'll be doing more readings, more exclusives, and um, this reading was, uh, well, this wasn't a reading. This exclusive was strictly for entertainment purposes only. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. And thank you for tuning in.